welcome to the show. Good evening, Lettuce Heads. It is I, Jim Lettuce, your fearless leader, coming at you with part nine. I intend to finish this game. That's all there is to it, okay? Anyways, click one of the links below. You can, uh, you know, buy something or sign up for something or whatever. Anyways, let's go. So I don't really remember what I'm doing, but I think I'm doing some kind of, you know, I'm going to have to fight some stuff, some puzzles probably. Oh great, we're starting off with a puzzle. What we got? Got a magic spot here. Got a magic dookie spot. Uh, what am I supposed to be looking at? Oh, what's, we gotta go over there. But how? Okay, it activated the the teleporter. It's like a, an alternate. There we go. I need to reposition that pillar to climb out of here. Perhaps the archway is the answer. Why doesn't it move? Yeah, just, just kick it around. Here? Is that right? Uh, let's see. We need to walk over here. Let's see. What's this? How do we get there? So I think the pillar is to, uh, why can't I move it? There. Is that what he means? Something about the arch. We haven't gone up here in this dimension yet. I'm going to have to look this up, aren't I? What is that like glowing part that like invisible is that right? God, I'm such an idiot. I'm going to have to look it up. Okay, so now there's a a pillar there. Okay. Now what? I guess I can climb on it. Here we go. I'm not a complete idiot. Just, you know, mostly idiot. Uh. Okay, here we go. We're going to fight something. That's where I shine. Oh, we got another magic dookie spot. Well, there's another thing. We're probably going to have to move it. That pillar is blocking the path. I'll need to move it. 
This one. I think I have to go through the different dimension to be able to lift it. Or not. Oh, hey, a chest. Cool. Yo, is that a cool wizard hat? Yo, hold up. Ooh, it's more of like a old wizard kind of thing. I like it. Okay, I don't remember the wall there. Is there any way to reposition this archway? This archway? And that one. Okay. I don't know how to move it if it's not small, right? Can I not, uh... How am I supposed to move it? Gosh, y'all, I'm such an idiot. My brain doesn't work this way. I want to fight stuff. Alright, he said something about moving the arch itself. How does one do that? I don't know. I really don't know what to do. Well, I guess we're going to go to Google. It's going to be something super obvious. Alright, that's the thing. There we go. Aha! Yay! I figured it out all by myself with no help at all. Alright, next trial. This looks like a boss fight. Okay, let's go. Come at me, bro. Ah, you're not scared, I see. Whoa. Gotta get him with that magic. Oh, is that it? Bitch, please, I'm the Dragonborn. Hell yeah. Alright, next trial. Probably another puzzle. 
Look at these graphics. They're amazing. Oh, we got a magical dookie spot. I must investigate the magical dookie spot. Hey, look, a chest. I believe I need to proceed to the left here, but how? Okay. Is there another switch? Gotta go that way. What if I hit it here? I'll go through here. Now what? But aren't I in backwards world right now? Or are we getting somewhere? There's a way. Can I pull this statue or something? Oh. Nope. Okay, I don't know what I did, but it worked. I mean, I did it on purpose. Oh, this is so trippy. Alright, where's my magical dookie spot? There we go. Okay, there's our portal. We got our block here. I don't know. I guess we want to go... Okay, that's blocked. We got some bad guys here. Isn't that like a... Oh, whoops. Okay. Come at me, bro. Oh, you weren't ready for that, were you? Punk ass. Hell yeah, I feel like a badass. Okay. Was this guy invisible? What the? Is it a glitch or is he supposed to be like that? Oh, I see. I gotta go through the portal to see him. That's kind of badass how he just pulls out another one. I got him with the Expelliarmus. Okay, is that a switch? Hitting those marks readjusts the archway. Perhaps there's a way forward from the other side of this one. I don't want to, uh... Leviosa. Now stay. I don't think that did anything. Did it? Alright, I don't know what that means. Climb on this? 
Yeah, it's not far enough. Wait, I think I gotta it move it. To pull one of those blocks through the archway. Through here? Akio. What um what's happening? Hmm. Yep, I'm gonna have to look this one up too. Can I just like push it? Oh, what? What does that mean? Put it here, I guess? <sighs> Alright. After pulling the block out through the archway, I can place it where it can be climbed on while on the other side of the archway. I'm such an idiot. This is so frustrating. Let's go back to the video. The level 18 pensive protector. There will be a few other enemies as well, which can get annoying and overwhelming, but overall this part isn't so bad, so make quick work of them all and move on. The third puzzle will also utilise the spinning floor mechanic, and it's fairly complicated. Investigate the floor in the middle, and then you can rotate the portal by hitting the switch behind, oh, but you have to hit it from the side, as it won't work if you try and do it through the portal. Once you've done this, you can go through the portal which is now on the right, and then immediately turn around and activate the switch again. This will move the portal and give you access to the path directly across from you, which is where you'll need to go. Now we're onto the final puzzle, which is also partly a fight as well, and this one is tough. As soon as you investigate the magic and activate the switch on the wall to the right, you'll initiate a battle with two pensive protectors. But there's a catch. You'll need to oh, yeah, guide yeah. the protectors through the portal in order for you to be able to see them. Otherwise, they're just a floating weapon that you can't actually attack. This can be quite awkward to do, but just keep dodging and running through the portal until they follow you. Then, once you've finally taken these two down, you can get on with the puzzle in peace. The puzzle itself is actually really confusing, but has a simple enough solution. Once you've investigated the magic on the floor, you can walk straight through the portal, turn around again, and the puzzle is done. Now, once you go back through the portal from the other side, the box on the ledge in front of you will become movable. So go up... Oh. So I had the right idea, I think. Sorta. Of. Uh, maybe this will work. What? Hmm. I think I'm an idiot. I kind of want to quit playing this game. It's making me frustrated. So in the video he had it here. Alright, I think that might have might have done something. No. But I think I have to Wingardium Leviosa it. Leviosa. Yay! 
neck item okay oh and I think I have to here we go see I didn't need help I know exactly what I'm doing whoa all right is this a fight I'm ready for a fight now oh, we got a chest that's awesome and we got some baddies Come at me, bro. Is this a puzzle room or is that just a nice statue piece? Okay, we got a magic dookie spot here. More puzzles, okay. How do I get to this chest? I see. Gotta do it quick. There we go. Hickory striped robe. That's kind of tight. Now what? Alright, I think I go here. I'm ready to get out of here. I want to fight stuff. Look at this epic spot. This is so cool. Wow. Alright, is this... I feel like there's a boss battle coming. Here we go. This looks like a boss battle. This is an arena for sure. Oh, that's not good. This guy. Oh. Alright, I know there's a final boss, so I can't get you yet. Here we go. Boss battle, here we go. Oh, snap.
I wonder if I've fought this guy before. Whoa. I'm about to go Superman. Woo! Come at me, bro. Come at me. Chip damage him. Oh, this is epic. Oh, that was a waste. It's red this time. Come at me, bro. He got me. He got me. I have a plant. It's pretty much done now. There he goes. You did. I forgot what this is for. What a relief. All in a day's work. That's so weird. Whoa. Some kind of wizard. Here we go. Unidentified items. Here we go. I will look upon your memories. Oh, look. A tear of memories. <clears throat> Yeah, just stick your hand in it. It's cool. Okay. Oh, it's a memory. Cutscene. Yeah, this is like a story that's been going along. His daughter gets sent away. I think she turns evil. Isadora. 
We are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Oh, he's gonna be like, get that magic out of here. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. Damn. Yeah, her brother died and she wanted vengeance. I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Oh, she did a spell on him. They're gonna expel her. Isadora. You can't take away a heart pain. Yeah, she's gonna be evil. Look, you can tell. What have you done? I took his pain. This is uncharted magic, Isadora. You can only see what has been sealed in the jar, and we do not know what power that may hold. But the traces of that magic is that ancient magic I've seen before. The magic I have. Because I'm the dragonborn. We haven't seen her yet. Did she die? Like in the present, I mean. Right, let's get out of here. Oh, I thought it was a chest. Yo, what's You're up, back. playboy? And in one piece, no less. Is that Percival? What's him? It is good to see you again. Professor Rookwood told me about what happened at Rookwood Castle. In light of the dire circumstances in which we find ourselves, it is most fortunate. So we're we gonna find a dragon again. Is following this path. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep the second artifact safe as you've advised. Good. Are you ready to move on? Um. Yeah, let's ask that. What did they? What did she pull out of his chest? What was the glowing strand that Isadora pulled from her father's chest? It was pain. You will understand more about her actions as you complete the trials. Ready? I'm ready for whatever comes next. In that case, introductions are in order. Allow me to introduce former Hogwarts headmistress, Neve Fitzgerald. Oh, we got a third person in a picture? Okay. How do you do? I must say that I was not entirely surprised to learn that a student had been completing the trials. I've not just any student. Students capable of the Dragonborn. Set their minds to. Thank you, Professor. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. I am certain that you are more than capable of completing my trial. However, I must first, how shall I say, prepare the location of what your What kind trial. of party favors are you going to put? We trust your judgment, Professor Fitzgerald. You should know better than anyone how to manage the inconvenience of, well... <coughs> a vainglorious and exasperating headmaster? Indeed I should. I shall confirm that everything is in order immediately. Wait, so she was a bad headmaster? Is that what he's saying? Professor is he talking smack? needs some time to clear the way forward. Until then, you should continue to hone your magic. Side if quest you learn time. more about Ranrock and Victor Rookwood's activities in the meantime, please let us know. Very well, Professor. All right, let's talk I to the Professor. Enough. Continue to hone my magic. You do learn quickly. Hopefully, you will soon hear from Lodgok as well, and we shall learn how he fared with the helmet you retrieved. Well done today, as always. Yeah, who was that? We shall speak again soon. All right. Yeah, this is new.
Oh, it's winter now. Time skip. Hell yeah. None of those kids got jackets on. Alright, we gotta go to this special secret room. Do I have mail? Alright. We gotta open our cool stuff. Oh, we got a lot. Hold on, let's unlock our stuff first. Then we'll do the quest. Secret rooms. Where's this one? That's where we were at. Natty told me about your run in with the poachers. I have some news about them as well. Poppy Sweeting? God, these are some British ass names. Read mail, L3. When you have a moment, please stop by the room of requirement. Deke mentioned you might be interested in learning how to breed beasts. Yes. I really want to learn that. Alright, we gotta go here. Identify everything. Oh, we got a purple. Hold up. Yo. Is it better than mine? What is it? 48, 57. This is way better. Alright, why not? And then. What was my cloak? But does it look cool? That purple's kind of dope. Kind of like that though. We'll go with that for a while. Okay. Let's change the look. I almost need to change this now. That's kind of tight. That almost works. Oh, that's good. I like that. All right, here we go. Now let's look at the quest. Fred and Vice, we... Poppy. Did I ever do that other quest for that dude? This is a uh, choir, rescue a deer recall and a giant purple toad. But I'll get Bombarda. I, I vaguely remember. We gotta do, let's meet up with Sebastian. We can't leave my boy hanging. Alright, let's go here. I have been asked to teach you the exploding charm, Bombarda. Once you have completed the tasks I've set forth, speak yeah. to me after class. Is that him? Lumos. Outside the Slytherin common room. Okay. Ready. You're here. Brilliant. Yeah, dude, we're homies. I received your owl. What happened with Ominous? I told him none of us will be able to avoid dark magic forever. So the more we know about Salazar Slytherin and the dark arts, the better prepared we'll be. Right. Unfortunately, only a Gaunt knows the location of the Scriptorium's entrance, and Ominous won't tell me. Hmm. Perhaps I should have a chat with Ominous. You? I suppose it's worth a try. But don't get your hopes up. Ominous is annoyingly stubborn. Nothing new. I know where he right. is. I'll lead you to him and then leave you to it. Come on. 
Am I gonna get the drop on him, or is this like a I do a quest for him? Lumos. All right, let's go. Keep an eye out. Never know who's watching. Although that hasn't stopped us before. Strictly speaking, right. we were caught. Damned poltergeist. Such a nuisance. Those darn poltergeists. Dude, walk faster. Uh oh. What's that? We got one of those magic butterflies. Oh no, they're all over the frame. Why is there no music there here? He Good luck. Okay, bye. Yo, let me holla at you. Let me holla at you. What are you doing here? Hello, Ominous. Do you have a moment? What is it? What have you and Sebastian been up to now? I owe you an apology, Ominous. I wasn't honest with you before about the Undercroft. Sebastian did show it to me. He wanted me to have a safe place to you practice jealous? spells to try and catch up to the other fifth years. He didn't think you'd mind. I suppose that makes sense. It's just Sebastian's been pestering me lately about something and I'm frustrated with him. Don't tell me he's still going on about, what was it, a scriptorium? He told you Scriptorium? About he did. We were talking about Hogwarts founders and he mentioned it. Wouldn't say much more though. Yes, well, he seems to think it contains the Why does this dude look like a serial I killer? Full of dark magic that is best left untouched. Wait, you've never been inside? Of course not. I only know about it because of my favorite aunt, Noctua. She thought like I do. Didn't agree with the family on the use of dark magic. In fact, she'd hoped to convince my family that there was more to Salazar Slytherin than worshipping pure blood status. She'd heard of this scriptorium and thought its contents might shed some light on him. She even found the secret entrance in this very corridor. She wrote regularly to my father about her efforts to secret gain access. Secret entrance? Let's go. No one else ever tried to enter. I'm sorry about your aunt. Don't you want to find out what happened to her? Aunt Noctua went down this path with good intentions and lost her life. I don't want the same to happen again. You don't know that history will repeat itself. Not Aunt Noctua. Besides, you said your aunt thought like you. This could honor her memory. Get you answers about Slytherin and Sebastian answers for Anne. Right. Your aunt pursued this alone. Look at those threads. Do it together. It's so crisp and clear even in done. this dark environment. I confess. You've convinced me. I didn't think it possible. Very well. I shall tell you what I know. Fetch Sebastian. I'll wait. I hope I okay. Can. We don't regret this. Sebastian, over here. These braziers grant access to the scriptorium. Now your share? You wouldn't tell me when I practically begged. It wasn't you who told me what I needed to hear. Opening the. Dude, he's got like a super villain pose. Free. Look at him. Well, Lumos. three heads are better than one. It's two heads are better than one. And by that this dude logic, looks like a vampire. Look at his eyes. Alright, we got more puzzles. Okay. Where's the door? Oh, hey. Got a scarf here. This is open the door. Okay, we got one of these magic things. Hello, Hamora. Here we go. The sound is so satisfying. Okay, wait, come back. Lumos. Come back, magical butterfly. You're coming with me. I'm gonna show you the world! Is that... What is this? Why can't I go over there? Alright. 
We got a magic fly. Can I unlock this? Hello for more. Sweet. Lumos. All right, we got. What? Why can't I go over there? Okay. Is it supposed to have everything off limits? Lumos. I guess we're not going there. So this is the Slytherin door? We didn't go all the way up here. Let's go up here. <clears throat> There's something up here. Wait. This is just like Hogwarts, right? Or is this part of the puzzle? Yeah. Wait, is that a chest? Nope. Just a bench. Oh, I see the little mini map. I went right out. Well, there's one. Lumos. Oh, we got some pillars. Maybe I need to light them here. Incendio. I don't know more. Works on its own. I wonder if it's a clue. What does that mean? Lumos. Incendio. It went out on its own, so what does that mean? Nothing happens. Those are lit. Maybe I gotta move it. I can't move it though. Lumos. We gotta. We got a bathroom Lumos. here. He said it went out, it's a clue, right? But a clue of what? I think I gotta put it there by the door, but how do I move it? I can try my air burst. No. So there's only one here. And these doors don't go anywhere. Lumos. Confringo. Yeah, we'll do square. That's incendio. Confringo. Hmm. Rebellio may help. Oh, I see. That's not the one I have. Revelio. Remember, no, no, no. Three braziers are involved. 
<laughs> Someone was actually looking. So I gotta get all I three. There we go. I hope we're ready for Lumos. this. Yeah. Dark, ominous corridors. My favorite. No comment. Come on, that was a good one. It's like a locked door. We may want to look around. Knocked his note. Must prove my point. Don't need dark arts. So his brother could access. We're going into a maze. Great. A journal entry. Signed by Noctua Gorns. <coughs> Gorns? Ominous. Your family was here. I know. She was my aunt. You knew? And didn't tell me. Ominous. Alright, sounds like y'all got Eternal some stuff to work out. Ahead. That's why I said this could be dangerous. Aunt Noctua kept my father informed until she vanished. Uh, he's like a spoiled rich kid. Alright, don't I have like a... Uh... Reparo. Reparo. There we go. The rubble forms the release of a person facing a snake. That must be the voice I hear. Oh, he can hear it? Uh oh. You speak that snake tongue? The voice is ancient. You hear a voice. It started when you repaired that relief. I hear a whisper saying, Speak to me. I'm oh, whoops. A mouth. I can hear and speak to snakes. Nearly all known parcel mouths are descended from Salazar Slytherin. I'd like to be able to talk to snakes. You might not want the ability to speak parcel tongue. Can you learn parcel tongue? It's often associated with dark wizards. I haven't spoken That sounds like a perfect thing for me to learn for my my role playing with this playthrough. Having second thoughts. Nope. I see no reason we should stop now. It's ironic. When I left home, I vowed to leave the dark arts behind, and yet here I am. Stand back. Uh oh. I feel like I'm making a I'm drug addict, like, this. take another hit. Lumos. It worked! Ominous. You possess a rare ability indeed. Between the two of you, I'm starting to feel left out. Between the two of us, I. Never mind. Are they banging each other? Is that why there's so much tension between them? There's no clear way forward. Were they a couple and like now they're having a fight? Is Salazar that it? Slytherin most likely was that a snake? The door we came from is closed. And there's more than one gate ahead. Then look closely at each gate for clues. Alright, look at the gates. Find clues. Got it. That is a Mondo spider web. Here we go. Wait, is this where we came in? I think that's where we came in. The dial requires focus. Aunt Noctua said the same. It may take practice to solve it. Oh my gosh, I get bit if I do it wrong? Rotate upper. Oh, I see. Lower. What? How am I going to know what the... That didn't sound good. Salazar Slytherin didn't make this easy. Hmm. Oh, here we go. This better tell us how. Challenge by challenge. So we gotta move the right. Legends getting lost and being unwelcome. Poor Aunt Noctua. That's gonna get me. This is looking rather dire. This I don't know. Lumos. How to do it. You're in a maze. Designed by Salazar, we are in a maze. I 
Guess I'm trying every combo. I don't know. How does this work? Now I'm gonna have to look this up too. Well, I'm gonna die. Is there like a a symbol on the wall or anything? <laughs> Shoot, I don't want to sneeze. Slither and lock. Find a way through. Didn't I see one of these Slytherin things over here? Oh. Alright, that one says... Like the horseshoe and the... Square with the slant, okay. Here, here. Yo, I did something. Matching the symbols did open it. Was about to do that myself. But you got to it first. Don't try to take credit. Nice work. All right. We got a new note. Not to a reference is painful and arduous challenges, but also rewards. Pain. That's the part I'm wary of. All I heard was rewards. Keep going. All right, now we got to open beetle and pyramid thing. Sideways beetle pyramid thing. Oh, I guess I already did it. So there's another. We're looking for another snake lock. Okay, that's the eyeball and that. Oh, here we go. I right, want eyeball and snake. Another gate. Seems Slytherin like to play games. Plus one in the family. Look in a mirror, Sebastian. Yeah, they're totally banging. That's why they're fighting. The dial solved. Impressive. Nice work. All right, we got another one. Another note. Failed. So he got stuck here. Your aunt wanted to change your family's traditions. She did. And she was my favorite person in the world for it. All right, what? Where's the door we need to open? We gotta look at the symbol there. So we already opened that one. Okay. Sideways beetle pyramid. Another, not the welcoming sort, was he? All right, here we go. We're getting somewhere. Excellent. Lumos. We're another step closer to the scriptorium. Where were they on the right? Over here. I spotted something ahead. Looks troubling. This whole place is troubling. If you're gonna cry about it. We cannot stop now. Alright, here we go. We got one of those doors that's like oozing liquid. That's never a good sign. The gate. I think we're locked in. Again. Then Salazar oh, creepy. is not yet finished with us. It's like the bad guy from Terminator 2. Liquid metal. We got another note here. Oh, the only way forward is a curse. All 
All right, I think we're gonna have to kill one of someone in the group. A skeleton. Sorry, Lucian or whatever. Uh, you seem like the weakest, so we're probably gonna kill you. By an unforgivable curse. Oh, that's not him. That's him. No offense. This is where we'll die. We're probably gonna kill you, bro. Ominous. I'm truly sorry about your aunt, but I know what to do. It's going to be difficult. Is he gonna kill him? I won't say nothing, bro. He's annoying. Tortured faces on the door, and Crucio is etched into the stone. My guess is if we pass the Cruciatus curse, the door will open. That's why Noctua died. She had no one to cast the curse on. Ominous has the most experience with this. He should cast it. Not on me. In Ominous's favor. Will you ask him about this? Um. Yeah, I'm persuasive. I'll do it. Seem a bit cross with you. I'll speak with him. Good. Work your magic, so to speak. All right, I'll talk to your angry boyfriend and talk him into torturing you or whatever. This is some kinky, weird stuff going on. I hadn't imagined we'd end up trapped like this. Salazar Slytherin did. He's to blame for many unimaginable things. I swear this kid's I a vampire. Sebastian and I won't do it. The Cruciatus curse is pure torture. I would know. Sebastian told me a little of what happened when you were young. So you got tortured you or something? Should have known he would have told you. And one always has a choice. I'm as guilty as the worst of my family. Ooh, Unforgivable burn. curses won't work unless you really mean them. I had to want to cause pain, and for that I shall never forgive myself. So I think his family forced him to do a curse. I have no family left. And he's got like PTSD you from it. You will need to sort out another solution. If you right. cast Crucio, you will regret it forever. Crucio. Well, I don't even know Crucio, so... What do we do now? Ominous is not going to cast the Cruciatus Curse again. Ridiculous! As if dying in here is a better option than casting a damned spell. <sighs> He's got PTSD, <sighs> bro. I can teach you Crucio, or I can cast it on you. Wait, you didn't say you knew how to cast Crucio. Because I'm not sure I do. Ominous knows that, yet he's left us no choice. I don't yearn to follow in Noctua Gaunt's footsteps. I think I can cast this if I have to. We're learning the curse, baby. Um. Very well, I don't want to learn it. I want to learn it, but you must cast it on me. I don't want to get cursed, so I'm going to do it to you. Sorry, loser. On the curse, and I think it's best if I cast it on you. Very well, if that's what you want. To perform the spell, raise your wand, point it at me, and firmly declare, Crucio. Hold on as long as you can. All right. All right, we got a curse. First evil spell of the game. Ready? I figure it wouldn't be bad to have it. I'm ready. Dang. This is getting epic. Then way to take one for the team, bro. No hard feelings. Are you Lumos. right? That pain. <sighs> I would have done anything to make it stop. <laughs> but I'll survive. <sighs> Let's keep moving. Like Wait. a boss. He just we walked it off. Our Slytherin scriptorium. Oh, I can't believe we're cool. here. Knowledge. Here we go. We got a book. Sebastian. Ominous. There's a book just here. You found something. You two go ahead. Let me know what's in it. I wander around a bit. Alright, we got a badass book. Weak ass scarf. What's up, what bro? Do you think? Looks like a spell book of some kind. This is incredible. A Hogwarts founder's possession. What an honor. 
Still can't believe uh, this is a regular Tuesday for me, bro. What she found. What will you do with Slytherin's spell book? What I do with every book? Read it. <laughs> Burn it. Professors' parents ingrained that habit early on, but I can do that later. For now, I say we explore this room. It's breathtaking. Think they got any other cool stuff here? We got another chest. Here we go. I don't want to leave. Face item. I owe you, both of you. Without both of you, we'd never have made it this far. We were lucky. We could have died. Fear will never come to a core. Never to do this again. Godric, isn't that the evil goblin? Discord. This creep creature. Best news I've heard all day. All right, so there's a creature. We got a dungeon. I guess we're going to the dungeon. Let us enter the dungeon. Let me save. I actually haven't saved in a while. Are right, y'all ready? Oh, all right, I guess I'm going by myself. Lewis, about your aunt, please. Oh, they came with me. I meant what I said before. We swear right now never to engage in anything to do with dark magic again. Understood. I'm truly sorry about your aunt, Ominous. We got a flu flame over here. I suppose after all this, I am oh, grateful okay. to know what happened to her. Thank you. Am I supposed to listen to their... Oh, that's it? I'm sitting here ready to fight something. Okay. Well, let's go to the room and see what that headpiece I got is. Well, I got a quest to talk to Deke anyways. Please come and talk to Deke. Curious spectacles. All right, which one of these quests is talk to Deke? Ugly. Why are my glasses so ugly? Oh, so I got this more like wizardly looking one. Well, this one's better. Oh, that's kind of tight. All right, what in where's the Deke quest? There. You want to talk to me, bro? Hello, Deke. You wanted to talk to me. Indeed. Uh, Deke thought you might want to learn how to build a breeding pen so that you can breed beasts. Yeah. That sounds like a very good idea. Rescuing and breeding beasts go hand in hand. Young beasts are particularly vulnerable to poachers. Those Pokemon, we're gonna capture them. Allow us to keep the younger ones safe. I see. Right, so I keeping them safe First, and breeding bring them. a pair of beasts to the room. One male, one female. Deke suggests rescuing Thestrals, as they're at great risk from poachers. A thestral? Noble creatures, but their relationship with death gives them a bad reputation. They're prized by poachers for their tail hairs. I've seen Thestrals before, but where would I find a pair of them nearby? 
Deke has seen some wild thestrals not too far from the Hogwarts grounds. Then you'll need to purchase a spellcraft for the pen from tomes and scrolls and gather the materials it requires. All right. Once you've rescued the thestrals and you have the spellcraft, you come and find Deke. Rescue a male thestral. Purchase a breeding pen spellcraft. Do I have any money? Six hundred. I could sell some stuff. Let's go to Hogsmeade. Where shall I buy? I guess it doesn't matter. Purchase breeding pen spellcraft. He said go here, so let's wait now. Gotta travel here. Alright, it's got markers for me. What is that quest? Oh yeah, broom. Well, I don't really use the broom. I use my eagle. Wait, is that telling me where? Oh, it's already marked in my map. Okay. Well, shoot, let's go there. What am I locked on to? We'll do that later. I guess we can do that. Let's see what's going on over there. Can I not get over there? Here. I don't know who this Poppy Sweeting is. Lumos. Oh, cool. Hey, didn't it say catch a frog? Isn't there like a way to open your bag? Already had it. Oops. Okay, let's. There we go, let's catch one of these frogs here. Yo, we got one. Professor Howen will never believe this. Nice. Now I gotta catch something else. Ooh, there's a bunch of enemies. Let's fight them. Are they people? Where are they? Did you hear that? I'll make you with your Don't go down easy. You sure about that? Ooh. Quite conductive, aren't we? There we go. There you go. Wait till now what? About this. An ash winder. Yeah. 
it's the controller speaker. It's right next to the mic. Here, I'll try to move it. <clears throat> we got some wolves here. It's always the best time to strike. Akio. The beasts are safer now. This looks intriguing. All right, we got fur, another scarf, so many scarves. Oh, is this guy good? Where are they running from? No, let's stay on the path. Lumos. Studying Salazar Sidder in Spellbook. Meet me in the Undercroft. I found something. All right. Enemies? Come at me, bro. Why didn't it throw it at him? Crescendo or whatever hurts him kind of. You got some skills? You got some skills? You just got sliced up. Pocus. Lumos. Lumos. Here we go. Wow, these graphics, they look so good. We're going to meet Poppy. Let's see like this. Now you've done it. Is it because he's a big dude? Is that why? Whoa. Whoa. I never seen anybody cast a tornado. Sounds like Shio Gora. Whoa! Oh. How dare you! How dare you! So I have the curse, the torture curse. Lumos. I think those uh Where are we going? Is that it's probably an exit door. Right? Lumos. Wait, I feel like we already came through here, didn't we? We got a chest. Alright. Ugly ass scarf. Okay. I'll take it. Lumos. 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 Here we go. Guess I wait. 
Going all the way up here. Let's talk to this girl. What does she want? High wing's fine. I'm keeping an eye on her. She's Is that an owl? Oh no, it's the bird. It's the, I met the bird through her. Far from it. You said you had news about the poachers, and that some of it had to do with me. It did. Yeah, they were trying to kill my bird horse. Did you know that they have orders from Victor Rookwood to capture you on sight? Does this have anything to do with Rookwood and Harlow coming for you in the three broomsticks after the troll attack? Maybe. It does somewhat, but at the moment I'm more concerned. Look, about what I'm important. The okay. Are up to. Fair enough. But I hope you'll let me know if I can be of help, especially after what you did. For I me. mean, you're like eleven. Hall mean anything to you? So I probably won't. Why? Uh, you know, ask you to go on a dangerous mission, but you know, the name came whatever. Twice, but they never went into detail. I also overheard one of them bragging about all the gold they're making at the expense of innocent creatures, undoubtedly. The poachers spoke of this area, and they're so I evil. If we searched around a bit, it might give us clues as to what they're doing. If you ever meet my gran, this trip never happened. Right. Not to worry, Poppy. If I ever meet your gran, I shall not speak a word of this. I normally tell her everything. She might be my best friend after Highwing, but she knows how I feel about the poachers. I think she worries I'll do something ill-advised. Whatever gave her that idea? This All right, way. I need these mushrooms. Fire and vice. Okay, I guess I'm following her. We're gonna parkour right now. She's gonna try to compete against the master of parkour. A centaur. Tread carefully. This is their territory. An entire castle to roam, yet you choose to wander here. Please, we don't want any trouble. We're simply passing through. Do you take us for fools <clears throat> that we do not notice more and more of your kind around here? No, we're trying to fight them. Approaches. We aren't involved with them. If anything, we want to see them stopped. I hope for your sake that is true. Our kind is swiftly losing patience with the poachers and those they work with. No, he's got no jacket on. All right. He was certainly a charmer. That could have gone worse. Centaurs aren't exactly fans of wizard kind. And the poachers aren't helping matters. But why would he think that we had anything to do with poachers? I did know because he's an idiot talking with a few villagers in Hogsmeade. I'm not sure why. Perhaps that's why the centaurs are suspicious. Maybe. I don't know. Uh oh. That's the third time I've seen a dugbog behave that violently. It's I mean, they are pretty violent, right? More aggressive than usual lately. I've noticed that too. It's almost Leech like juice. It's in the water. Right. Maybe he had a rough upbringing, okay? Why can't I run? This is odd. What is it? Not entirely sure, but look around. If the poachers were here, perhaps we can find out why. Just Investigate. They can't have been gone long. You'll take all their stuff. I'm just taking their stuff, drinking their drink. Signs of poachers. Here we go. Why wouldn't they take their cages with them when they left? I think they got eaten by the the dig dug. See, look, something broke over here and just got them.
Am I supposed to like look in here? It's saving like I'm supposed to be here. I'm not seeing anything. Just getting my robe all wet. Right, let's go over here. I see like a chest. Cool. How do I? I'm not seeing anything. Nothing is attacking me. Did I not look at something? Pelt. Poor beasts. It's like the pacing just stops. Every like 20 minutes, it's like, oh, now you gotta do some, some puzzle where there's like a lever right in front of my face, but I don't see it. I mean, what else is there? We looked at the cage, the... I never would have went over there. I never would have found it, ever, in a million years. Rebellio. I gotta get used to doing Revelio. This is goblin metal. It seems out of place in a poacher camp. Uh-oh. Goblin poachers. About it. Anything interesting? Yeah. Goblin poachers. Poachers were here. All sorts of evidence. But I found something else. It's goblin made. I found goblin armor. Let's keep searching, but carefully. Merlin only knows what's going on here. I'm not afraid of goblins. I don't have a good feeling about this. All right. How do goblin and poacher interests align? Look at that. Skyline. Look, down there. Wow. Definitely poachers. No oh. creatures though. So what are they doing out here? Let's take a closer look. They won't be happy to see us. Should we use disillusionment? Or perhaps a less discreet approach? Hard to say from up here. Let's get a better lay of the land. No, I'm gonna go in guns blazing. Screw you. Come at me, bro. Oh, he's dead. What have you done? Incendio. Back in the ground. Back for more. Not the brightest. Oh, got him good. Got burnt and fell off a cliff. Regarding the minister for magic himself, what is going on here? Only one way to find out. Look, I'm a badass. Okay, these things happen. Do I have an extra talent? Here we go. So here we got better Revelio. 
Enemies in the air give you better magic. We got striking frozen. Cool, okay. Bombarda. You know, let's look at the evil stuff. We did get a curse. Dealing damage to curse target inflicts damage. Stupefy has the same effect as the curse on an enemy. Stupefy is like the counter attack. Spelliarmus. What's this one? Filipino. So this just adds curse to everything. That's not a bad one to have, but we'll try not to use it. This one looks a lot more useful. All right, we're going to wait. What do I have? I have a frog. Can I ride it? Do I get a reward for this? No. Oh, cool. I want one of those. Oh, shoot. Never mind. There's a cat. Quests. We got new ones. Poachers are up to something. Isn't that what I'm on? Yeah, let's go. Let's just finish this. Yoink. It's probably going to be like a giant, like, arena. What in yep. Merlin's name? Oh, snap. Dragon oh, fighting. Dragons? It's an underground dragon fighting ring. Whoa. I didn't know they had this in the game. Epic. It's a dragon fighting ring. This is Horntail Hall. Horntail Hall. And the secrecy. No wonder the poachers were in Hogsmeade so much. Likely taking bets and spreading the word. Given how crowded it is here, how could they possibly enjoy this? The centaurs have every right to be disgusted with wizards. Yo, how do we bet on the fight? More dragons here. The poachers are far too greedy to run a fighting ring with only two dragons. We should take advantage of most eyes being in the fight and look around. But be discreet. You especially can't afford to be spotted. All right. I guess we'll be secret. I don't know what Victor was thinking, striking a bargain with him. You better be a bit. Wait, how does he see me? You're gonna regret. Okay. As if you could. I guess we're fighting. <laughs> Alright, he's dead. I thought I was invisible. How could he see me? Oh, okay, this is like another way. Have you heard from your family? Has even of your brothers come round to our way of thinking? Will they join us? Ah, they say we go too far. The violence isn't going to get us what we want. <laughs> I say, if every last wizard is run through with a blade, then violence is going to get me precisely what I want. Probably have to fight him on the way out. Alongside any of them. Don't know how Ramrock starts Don't look at me. Rookwood. Yeah. see me? Oh great, they see me anyways. Okay, let's go. Oh, you aren't ready for that. Got 
Got him. You can see him fighting out there. This is awesome. Wow, my money's on the green. They're just gonna walk around. Did you hear those goblins? Ramrock and the poachers must be working together. Poppy, something's going on behind you. Oh, uh, what? You better not get kidnapped. What's going on down there? Oh, they're torturing him. They must we gotta have save it. Her. She's putting up quite the fight. Not a fair one, though. Not with her chained up like that. Let's even her up, shall we? Man, we are just rocking the boat tonight. Thought we were supposed to keep a low profile. Look, they've got a dragon egg. Hepperdean from the looks of it. Can't leave it here, not with the plans they likely have for it. Can I raise a dragon? Yo. Aloha Mora. There we go. He'll take it. It's purple. Cool. All right. All right. I have a dragon it. egg. Ready. The element of surprise will only buy us a few seconds. Let's, Ooh, let's take all this count. money first. Oh, you can't go that way. Let's take all these Wigan Weld potions. All right, let me save before. I feel like I'm about to do something crazy. We're 21 hours in. Okay. Not bad. You got sliced up. Woo! You aren't ready. Come here. You did. Sure that that shield grab. I know they got they got my girl. Save it. It's gonna try to eat us though. You're the one we're looking for, and you brought a friend. Alright. Guess we're fighting. Came back to life. Alright, so let's try that curse. Him. 
Yeah, it's doing damage. That's actually very powerful. You ready? Come at me, bro. You got served. We need to free her now before more show up. All right, all right, all right. How do I free him? Aim for the ring for the her restraints. Oh, there we go. No. Just aim for the ring. Oh, wait, I think I have to. Is that it? Something's happening. Oh no, it's gonna try to eat us. This may have been a bad idea. I suppose we'll find out. Cool purple eyes. Oh snap. Awesome. Are we friends now? Thank you, Dragonborn. See, I'm Dragonborn. Always helping dragons, no matter what game. This way. That was epic. That was a Hebridean black. I'm guessing the egg we have belongs to that dragon. <clears throat> yeah. I don't think You're she right. knew they had her egg. She wouldn't have left without it. What now? She didn't exactly leave us a calling card. I I don't know. Nothing about this day was expected. Not the goblins. That was and epic. Definitely not the fighting ring. The last thing I planned on was a dragon egg. And the poachers saw us, which cannot be good. What should we do with the egg? Since the dragon we freed flew off, does that mean we get to keep the egg? I'd much rather we have it than the poachers, at least for now. Yes, we know much we better. Keep it indefinitely. It'll be hard hiding it sounds a bit naive. from Professor Weasley for long. We aren't helping ourselves standing here. Let's get to safety. We can sort this out later. You're right. right. If there's anything the poachers are good at, it's tracking their prey. And right now we're it. Be careful, won't you? I shall see you back at the castle. Lumos. Lumos. Okay, bye. Freaking 11 year old girl just go walk off in the woods. I mean, she's. She's magic, so I guess that's cool. Well. Did a lot of magic. The time you learned the transformation spell. Ooh. After Cool. So I think we'll save that for next time. We're at like two hours. It's probably less because I'm going to cut out all the times I had to Google something. So hour and some change. Anyways. 
Stay tuned next time for part 10. I'll uh, learn these new spells. Hopefully tame a beast. Today was mostly uh, puzzles and dragons. Anyways, if you want to support us, go to our website, sign up, buy our merch, check out the Patreon. I'm Jim Lettuce. Drive safe and shit. <laughs>